honey, where you go, a man she anything but calm. A regular pint size, I had a bomb. Alright guys, this is Mithril back with another Fallout 4 video, and today I think we're going to finish the Far Harbor main quest. Uh I believe so. And I believe it's doing this one, which is to destroy the nucleus. Bring down, confront Dima. All right, let's do this. So what do we have to do? This one is for what? Bring down Far Harbor's defenses? No thanks. To destroy the nucleus. Sure, let's go and destroy the nucleus. Whatever. We will side with Far Harbor, I guess. I know I'm part of the Institute and all, and I should be helping out the synths, but nah. Watch yourself. These guys are rogue synths. Okay, somewhere up there. I know that you can hear me. For a second, I thought that guy was like, oh, What is he doing up there? Hey. Be respectful. You walk through hallowed halls. We cool? We're not cool. Okay, now everyone hits us. Oh, and it is full rads in here. How do, how do I get out of here again? Escape. Get me out of here. A nice long loading screen to start us off. Lockdown in five, four, three. Run. Children, we are beset. One. Lockdown complete. Commencing launch. What's happening? Oh, that's what's happening. Oh no, I. You receive the Far Harbor Survivalist perk, which grants a bonus to all damage resistant types. Okay, I can get down with that. And then, but I want to use the Harvester because I went and uh, upgraded it. Mm. It's better than it was before, but I'm not sure how much I like it. Because now it causes bleed. And it causes them to stagger. Yeah, it's the radium rifles that were doing all that damage to me. Nick, I hope you're not in there. Close to home. All right, Nick made it. Sweet.
I think we can put away the harvester. That's not the right room. So Kasumi. Kasumi. Why do you even call me Nick? Hey, Kasumi. You know me that explosion. It was you, wasn't it? You used something in Dima's memories to destroy the children of Adam. Um. The island's gonna be a lot safer with that cult gone. You're okay with that? Deciding yeah. who lives and no. who dies? Oh, yeah. I, like I don't know if I could have made that choice. Hey, listen. For a long time. So, when you first showed up, you came to get me. Yes. To bring me home. I've been thinking a lot about that. I hurt Kenji and Ray by leaving, didn't I? I could have just stayed home, pretended everything was all right, but I left them. Should I go back? They obviously still care about me. Or who they think I am. They need a daughter. They deserve to have one. Everything in Acadia has been settled. I found my answers. Maybe it's time I did something for someone else. Um, what do you mean? What are you talking about? I know the real Kasumi is dead. She was replaced with me, but do Kenji and Ray really need to know that? What if we could be a family again? All I have to do is go home. Give them the daughter they thought they lost. Don't I owe them that? Sure. You're right, Kasumi. They need you. Go home. I will. I'll start gathering my supplies and... I'll have to say goodbye to everyone. Thanks. For everything. Maybe I'll see you back in the Commonwealth? Maybe. Okay. Talk to Mr. Nakano. I wonder, is she really a synth? I don't think she is. I think she's just, like, confused. If she dies, though, does she have, like, the synth component? Oh, there she is. Mom? Dad? I'm... I'm home. Kasumi? I brought her back. Oh my god. My baby is okay. Welcome back home, Kasumi. It's good to be home. You... You saved my daughter. Thank you. Happy to help. do it, Kenji. You don't often see kindness in the Commonwealth. I'll never forget this. If any of you ever need help again, you know where to find us. Kasumi, does this mean you know we're your parents, right? You're not a synth. I know, Mom. I'm sorry. I was just so confused. I wanted to go somewhere. Anywhere. It's okay, Kasumi. You're home now. Um, yeah, hold on to her. No, I don't know if that's like a nice sentiment or like, hold on to her, Kenji. Listen to Kasumi next time, Kenji. We'll just go that way. Don't just try to keep her safe. Talk to her. I know. I will. I was holding on so tightly, I almost lost her. There's one last thing you and I need to discuss. Your reward for bringing my daughter home yeah. safely. We don't have much to offer, but my father traveled the Commonwealth. He had quite a collection before he died. I buried it all near the house. I'm not the explorer he was. I don't need them. I think they would be better with you. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Kenji. You've earned it. You traveled far and back to get me answers. Thank you again. 
You saved my family. We won't forget that. See you around, Kenji. Goodbye, Nick. Best of luck to you and your partner in the future. All right, let's go find this treasure. And then I think Nick needs to talk to us again. You buried it in your shed? Bats. Okay, just looks like a random weapon. Typewriter. Alright. I don't need that rifle. Let's drop this one. Alright, Nick. Hey. I'm all ears. Let's let's have a talk, you and I. Nick. Any chance you've rethought helping me close out some Nick Valentine history? Sure thing. Sure thing. What's the case? Well, this one's straight out of the archives. Once upon a time in the land of Boston, there lived a king of organized crime, Eddie Winter. He was a bad man who did a lot of bad things, hurt a lot of innocent people, but he knew the end was coming. So he sealed himself inside a personal shelter located underneath a sub shop he used as a headquarters. Uh, you remember him? Eddie Winter was from my time. Oh, I remember him. Little scumbag. The story gets even more twisted. The arrogant bastard wanted to cheat death. Live forever. Is this all part of so the, uh, out of that shelter someday close to home quest? Brave new world. Sound familiar? Only Eddie didn't want to be a frozen banana. No cryo sleep for him, no. He invested his money in some sick crazy radiation experiment mm, you've done your homework jeez you've really done your homework on this guy i have i uncovered a doozy eddie winter went and turned himself into a ghoul 200 years before it was fashionable hell he was probably the first one and i'm convinced that he's still locked inside that shelter safe and sound ready to come out and begin his evil reign all over again i'm gonna find him and kill him so that never happens you in of course all right nick let's get the bad guy you're a good man now i know where winter's vault is but the door is sealed with a complex numerical code lucky for us winter's arrogance knew no bounds back in the day he recorded 10 holotapes incriminating different criminal associates. On each one, he hit a single number. We find all of those holotapes, we get all the numbers. We get all the numbers, we get the code. And then we get Winter. I've been putting together a file on this one for a while now. There's a pair of holotapes in here worth listening to. Uh, including one of winters all right i do not think this is part of the far harbor quest line at all swarmed by ferals on my way out the door i spotted an active evidence terminal i'll bet my hat that terminal is the key to finding the rest of the tapes probably worth revisiting any police departments you may have stumbled across in your travels as well yeah i don't think this is part of the quest Uh, it says talk to Nick and talk to Ellie. Heads up. There's something you need? Oh my god, come on. Hey, Valentine. In this line of work, you have to expect the unexpected. Still, I've got to admit, I've never had a case quite like Kasumi's. It was quite an adventure. It turned out to be quite an adventure. Yeah, a whole island trying to kill us. He is hoping the next case just takes us to some dingy bar. I could use a slow one. I'm glad things ended as well as they have. The Nakanos are a happy family again. As much as anyone around here can be. All right, then it says talk to Ellie, and Ellie's in Diamond City. Okay, so we'll go to Diamond City, and then we're going to go to the Institute to inform them of the synths. And then we will probably get the combat armor in in the video.
And the next time we will be at Nuka World. And then I don't know what I'm going to do after Fallout 4. They're back. How did everything go with the Nakano case? Uh, I found their daughter. I tracked Kenji's daughter to a synth refuge up north near Far Harbor. She's back home, safe and sound. That's great. We don't often get to bring people good news. It's a nice change of pace. Thanks for coming in for this one. I knew something good was happening when you and Nick started working together. Don't be a stranger, Gumshoe. If I didn't know better, I'd say you're giving our friend here all the credit. Just keeping you on your toes, Nick. Okay. And then let's go and form the Institute. And don't need that. Who do I gotta talk to? Hear, that rogue sent at Libertalia was a real menace. Glad it's back where it belongs. Uh hey. I have several projects going well, um, right now, but one more shouldn't be an issue. I need to talk to someone about a situation up north. Pleasure to meet you. William Mosley, Advanced Systems. I'm happy to help in whatever capacity I can. I hope I don't disappoint. Uh you'll be fine. I'm sure you'll be fine. Thank you, Director. Listen. Place called Acadia. There's a place called Acadia. Acadia. That sounds so familiar. Where have I heard it before? Just tell me whatever you can. Uh synth named Dima. A synth calling himself Dima is running things. Synths giving themselves new designations is certainly never a good sign. And he's manipulating others? This certainly sounds like something the SRB needs to look into. What else can you tell me? It's fortified. They've holed up in an old observatory. Looks like a fortified location. So an effort to reclaim them has been anticipated. All right. It's a good thing you brought this to my attention. Is there anything else? They're growing in number. There are a good number of them already, and they're actively looking for more. Definitely concerning. Individuals aren't that difficult to reclaim, but large groups are trickier. Okay, I've heard enough. This clearly needs our attention, but being up north it's going to be difficult to deal with. You know what would make this easier? If what? we had their recall codes, that would help minimize asset loss. We can put together a response to this, but not immediately. The more data we have, the better. Sounds like sending in a courser isn't an option right now. But if you've already made contact and they trust you, learn whatever you can about them. I'll talk to Advanced Systems about recalibrating the relay and putting a team together. I'm on it. I'm on it. I'll make sure you get whatever support you need. All right. I was hoping that would just be like me telling them about it and they'd be like, okay, we'll go there. But I guess not. I guess not. I guess let's just go and get these uh, combat armor pieces. Luckily, I have this dive suit because I know some of them are in the water. All right, where's the nearest one? All the way down here. Uh, where's the second nearest one? Okay. All right, so Let's just go here, I guess. Uh, 
Which way is it? This one. Uh oh. For a second, I thought I was stuck. Okay, then let's put on our dive suit. Breathe in water and protection from radiation. Pretty dark down here. Does look like a dive suit. Right arm and left arm. Uh oh. And I'm already over encumbered. I have one weight. Uh, what can I get rid of? Nope. Can't get rid of all that. Maybe I have some heavy junk. I know what I can get rid of. We're going to drop about half of my rad away. I can always get more later. This way. Lure weed. Your pip boy doesn't sound. What? Don't I have the dive suit on? Let's say we get out of here. Maybe it's just rads from the ocean. What is going to be on this ship over here? Honestly, you probably don't even need the dive suit. Oh, it's too much again already. Feeling lucky? Somewhere this way. Looks to be some sort of fish dock right here. That lighthouse looks like it's floating over there. I'm floating away. Okay, hold on. What? Do you freestyle underwater? You know how hard it is to freestyle underwater? Alright, let's see what this armor looks like. What is this military wet to? Just kind of looks like... I don't even know. Does that mean you can have it on underneath for this uh, assault rifle? Guess so. 
Oh wow, this actually kind of looks pretty cool. Wasn't there something else to... Marine Tactical Helmet. 191910. Well, oh, that's worse. Oh, and it looks kind of weird, too. You have this big, bulky armor and then that weird, small helmet. So, if I were to say... Have this on instead... Oh yeah, then look at that. Alright, I might start wearing this instead. Let me... Go somewhere like the Commonwealth. And see if this can be upgraded at all. Rated? I am. Oh, why is this power armor just here? Okay. Inquisitors. Inside, you got uh, zealots 383850. Okay, that switches. I can't tell if this was storage or trash. Improves carrying capacity. I might need that on this. Deep pocket. What is this lighter build? Pocketed. Unarmed damage. Need more leather, but okay, yeah, it can be upgraded. What about the. Where is it? No. Oh, I guess you can't upgrade the wetsuit. All right. So yeah, you're definitely going to want to wear this stuff. Weird. All right. How does this look when I have my synth helmet on? Oh man, if that was like in black. Well, anyways, guys, uh, I know today was a little bit of a short one, but yeah, we finished it, and so I hope you enjoyed today's video, because if you did, make sure to leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe, because it will help on my channel, and I will appreciate it like always. And then next time, we're going to be going into Nuka World, so that's exciting. And then after Nuka World, I don't know, so I might need, like, suggestions about what to play. But yeah, guys, this is uh, Mithril, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. I'm on, baby, I'm on.